What is up, YouTube? Good again here, back at it with another My League Resimulation. And today we are doing none other than Kevin Durant, KD. Resimulating his entire career. We're going to see what he would put up, what kind of numbers he would put up, what kind of legend he would become with no injuries. Drafted in 2007. Now the game is a lot, a lot faster. A lot of threes being thrown up. So let's see how much that affects his scoring. We'll kind of compare him to real life KD. Since real life KD will still be in the game. I left them in. Since he should be out of the league while we're still most likely in our prime. So I, I left them in. So far, we're in the NBA draft, but before the video starts, make sure to smash the like button for me. Drop a comment down below who'd you like to see next, but uh, let's get to it. I'm gonna resume the draft so far if you guys, okay. Just to catch you guys up, I was gonna do this. I was gonna see who he was gonna go to because I didn't want him to go to the Pistons, the Warriors, uh, the Timberwolves. I've done resims and the players have gone to the Warriors, Timberwolves too many times, so I wanted a new team. If he goes to the Cavaliers, I'm cool with it. If he goes to the Knicks, I'm cool with it. Kevin Durant is going to the Cleveland Cavaliers to see if he could put up better numbers, see if he could get a championship faster than what LeBron did. Bring a second championship to the Cavaliers. Let's go check what kind of roster KD has for his rookie season. Darius Garland at a 75 overall. Colin Sexton is a straight scorer in 2K, man. He just, that's what he, that's all he does. Literally all he does. But he ends up doing it efficiently. So we got a score there in Colin Sexton. KD at the small forward spot, obviously. 6'9", 6'10", 6'11", whatever his height is. 7 foot. <laughs> we'll leave him at 6'9", though. Kevin Love is the power forward. Forward. Drummond is the center. This team does not look bad year one. Playoffs in the East. I could see that happening. Maybe just wait for Garland Sexton to improve. Durant's clearly going to hit a 99 eventually. And then the bench, they got two 80s off of it. A 76, a 76. And they're running a nightmare rotation. This is... This looks kind of nice. Young pieces that hopefully they keep together, improve them together, maybe trade Kevin Love. He really doesn't fit the timeline here. He could be that vet, but still. He doesn't fit the timeline. There's a 20 year old. There's a 21 year old. There's a 19 year old KD. Drummond's still only 27. But KD, a rookie in Cleveland. I'm actually interested. I'm interested to see if he's going to leave the team eventually, if he's going to bring these guys to a championship. Uh, I'm excited. I'm excited for KD, the best scorer that the game has ever seen. And he's got 11 badges to start out with. All of them. Wait, is everything on gold? Everything's legit on gold. What? Okay. Rookie season, KD, Cavaliers. Does he lead them to a playoff appearance right away? I mean, I, what I would love is that they miss the playoffs. They get another lottery pick. They get more pieces to help KD just become incredible, win multiple rings, win multiple MVP awards, and then what comes with it in, in uh, all-star appearances, stuff like that. But what I care about is those MVP awards, those championships. Let's see how many KD gets in his new career here, starting off in 2020 with the Cleveland Cavaliers. Season one, Giannis is the MVP. We finished 47 and 35. I think we're on our way to a, a, a legendary, even more legendary career than KD has had so far in real life. KD puts up 24 almost. Five rebounds, five assists, 1.6 steals, 1.4 blocks. Rookie of the year easily. And he's only going to get better. Those are already, in my opinion, he could have made an all-star team. I checked, though. He did not. Brandon Clark wins six man of the... Really? That, I mean, those are some solid, solid numbers. But that's dope for a second-year player. Six man of the year. Kawhi Leonard wins defensive player. Porzingis wins most improved. Brett Brown, 64 wins. And, of course, all rookie first team. We win rookie of the year. We're supposed to be there. We finished fifth. How good is the East? I want to see 64 and 18. Then Atlanta, one game ahead. Brooklyn, we finished... Better than the actual KD with Kyrie Irving on the squad. Carmelo at their four. DeAndre Jordan, Spencer Dinwiddie. Okay, yeah, I mean, um, we're already better. We're already better. The young, the youth is the future here. We're going to go ahead. We saw his stats. Um, I don't know if you guys want to see anything else year one, but let's see. KD, they didn't make an all-star appearance just to show you guys. I thought he would. I thought he'd be rookie, you know, a rookie all-star. He has the numbers for it, in my opinion. But obviously, a lot of these other guys have ridiculous numbers. The real KD probably put up better numbers. And in season number one, we were in the, this. Okay. Okay. That's a great. No way. No way. Is he going to get a chance? What kind of numbers is he putting up? What kind of numbers is he putting up in the playoffs? 26 
5.7 rebounds, 6 assists, 2.3 steals, 1.6 blocks, 50, 40, 80%, 36.5 minutes a game. Dude, carry us to a year one championship. Seven games. Seven games against a number two seed. We beat the number one seed. We couldn't beat the top two teams in the East, but I'm guessing Luka wins it here. Luka destroys. 26, 12, and 9. Three steals for Luka, man. It would have been amazing as a rookie reaching the finals, but a conference finals appearance as a rookie. Well, we're clearly not going to get a another lottery pick. Let's just go see how much rookie KD improves. He, so what? Was it 81? What was he? In 81? I already forgot. In 82? Something like that. Anyways, he goes up for... Yeah, so he was an 82 overall. He goes up four to an 86. Everything absolutely improves. I don't even know what to improve. Do I send him to a combo guard, make him an elite passer? Do I make him a better defender early on since he's only a C- minus and a D in an inside defense? So that might be it. Um, I think maybe wait, I want to see my other players. Okay, so Drummond's still here. Obviously, Drummond is putting up numbers. Yep, 13 rebounds. Colin Sexton, what did he do? 20 game. So, like, the team's really solid. Uh, K Love at the age of 32 improves a bit. Tristan Thompson, uh, lots of green. I mean, a lot of youth, which makes sense. But some of these guys, like a 26 year old, like that, those still impress me when they go up like that. Mike Young, Paul, what were they in like the G League? So, a lot of improvement to the youth. I expect the finals appearance. I expect the finals appearance with KD just completely de destroying anything on the Hall of Fame yet. Not yet, but he does get uh, more badges. I think he started at 11. Now he's at 18. Tight handles is there. Blood shooter, dead eye, deep fades. Here we go. Here we go. Year two. Going to be the best score the game has ever seen. Um, unless the team gets way too good and he can't average more than like 30 points, but he's going to. Keep giving them the minutes, which they should. He's a generational talent here, and this team is not horrible. So, I see, I see positive. I see positive things as long as the kind of keep the youth together. Don't do dumb trades. Don't make dumb signings. And a year two All Star appearance from here on out, an All Star. There's no way he's not. There's no way he's not. If he 2K, you're tripping. This team is elite already year two just because of KD. And that makes sense to me. That makes perfect sense to me. He's an all-star. Old KD makes it. He's 33 years old. But where's young KD? Where is he? He's right there. He's right there. I'm not. I'm going to hold out on looking at his stats. But year two, scoring machine, 18 total badges, 88 overall, leading his team to a 41-14 and 14 record right now. <laughs> That's okay. Okay. He's going to get a lot of championships for Cleveland. And I'm hoping he does not become a snake. He doesn't leave Cleveland. And he stays here his entire career. Luka Doncic is the MVP. I expect KD to get a few of these in a row. In a row. In a row. Bobo Rookie of the Year for Orlando. Cole Anthony wins Sixth Man of the Year for Golden State. Kawhi Leonard Defensive Player of the Year. What the, what the frick? That's the first time I've seen him on the Hornets in any sim. The Hornets? RJ Hampton, Most Improved Player. Coach of the Year. Our coach. 63 wins, of course. And why did he go to the Hornets? I don't even care about KD right now. I care about Kawhi. Why? why? We'll go. Okay, we're going to go check out his team to see if they're any good. Year 2, KD leads his team to a number one seed. He's the leading scorer. He's the second leading uh, passer on the team. Uh, leading stealer. Leading blocker. So, the man is elite. There's nothing. There's no other word. Legendary already year two an all-star and from here on out He should only continue to make all-star teams unless for some reason he gets like 28 minutes a game or something, but that would be absolutely dumb And now I want to see what team Charlotte has. What do you guys got? George Hill and 81 overall Killian Hayes. Okay, so he's got some youth there to help him out. But Kawhi, why would you go? Why? Danilo Gallinari, Dwight Howard again on the Hornets. PJ Washington is still there. Malik Monk still there. 80 overalls. Terry still there. Okay, what the? Duncan Robinson all the way at the end of the bench. That's a rare one. That's a rare one for Kawhi to go there. But let's go ahead and get to the uh, finals this year. Instead of just the conference finals, year two championship for Kevin Durant coming right up, up against Philly. We beat them last time and they were number one. But they got Chris Paul at the one. Ben Simmons at the small forward spot. Capella. And Embiid. And Ennis Cantor. Okay, wait. That rebounding is absolutely insane. But we get past them 4-3. Now we are up against the Sacramento Kings of all teams. De'Aaron Fox. RJ Hampton's got to be put. Oh, he's only put up 16. Never mind. Never mind. But they got Miles Bridges. Nikola Mirotic. Only 13 points a game. 16 for Marvin. Uh, De'Aaron Fox has to be going off then. He has to be going off. 
13. How were they in the finals? Are they playing some like ridiculous team ball? We're going to simulate game by game. Let's just compare. Their point guard is better. Our shooting guard is better. Our KD is better in year two already. Uh, Julius Randle, Kevin Love, around the same. And then Drummond, Bagley, same thing. It's a toss up. It's a toss up. But KD is the difference maker. KD is the difference maker. And he's going to get a championship year two. And I'm excited for more. I am excited for more. There's no way. Kings. There's no way this Kings team. I don't see it. I don't even like their team. They don't look good. Simulate. And do we win a championship? Do we come back? They're coming back. We were down after the first. Do I jump in to see a little bit of KD action? And they demolish. So maybe in the future when he's a little bit better. Championship number one already easily. KD finals MVP at the age of 20. Which is tied for the youngest MVP in Magic Johnson. He was 20, year old, uh, 20 years old as well. I wonder how many days, but but it, it, it it's just tied. He's, he's the youngest finals MVP now. 23, 7, 5, 2 steals, 1.2 blocks, 45%, 23% from three. Okay, that's a little, you just, <laughs> he just, he just couldn't shoot from long range, but already a ring on his finger. How many more can he add? Year three, still on his rookie scale contract, and he already has a ring, man. I don't usually get early rings like this for simulations so i'm i'm happy i'm happy the team's still improving he's a 91 overall k love goes up to, i'm pretty sure another one overall to an 84 why i have no idea tristan thompson kevin porter jr now getting significant minutes he's gonna be a beast our bench full of 80s our bench full of 80s and the team has a 91 overall star mvp season year three MVP season year three I will take that he's gonna make an all-star team again there's no question about it now to see what other accolades he could get and how many in a row Luka Dodge is still winning MVP out here I want KD to win one and money base rookie of the year for the Raptors Bull Bull six man now oh he's on a different team he won rookie of the year last season now he went six man for a different team defensive player Anthony Davis most improved uh Nafal, Naf, 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 I don't know how to say his name man Dante Dante Dance. Brett Brown, coach of the year. We finished 58 and 24, so we got either some more competition or we just, I don't know, we just suck. We just suck more. Cleveland Cavalier KD makes an All NBA second team. We're waiting for the All NBA first team and that MVP. That MVP, he already has a finals MVP. Old KD makes it on an All NBA third team, so we are definitely surpassing him already. Second seed. How far were we off from um, from the number one seed? Five games behind, but we've beat them before when we were the, like the fifth seed? Fifth seed, and they were the number one seed, so maybe. Maybe we got another chance. And then the Western Conference is kind of... Su it sucks. A 38-win team makes the playoffs. Let's go look at KD's numbers, though. I did not check his numbers yet. 24.6. When is he going to average like 30? Colin, you're too much of a score for us, man. Too much of a score. Garland puts up 18 and almost nine uh, assists. K Love 14. Kevin Porter Jr. a beast off the bench. Like, there's too much scoring for our boy. He's got a lot of help. But, of course, all you need to do is go off in these playoffs. Get us another champion. Get us another championship. He already got a championship for Cleveland. Let's go ahead. Oh, oh. What? Why? Frank Nidokina. RJ Bear. Okay. Wait, what? Are the, the New York Pistons? Anthony Edwards is there. Okay, Anthony Edwards is 38 in the first. 60%, 54% from three, and 96% from the three. <laughs> These downloaded draft classes are ridiculous. They got Jonathan here as well, man. Um, this team does look scary just because of Anthony Edwards right now. RJ Barrett, what's he putting up? 31 point. Excuse me? Bro, I understand now. They're absolutely popping off, but they lose to a 60. Oh, my God. The Bulls went to the finals. The Bulls went to the finals. Who do my Bulls have that they got there? Zion wins a uh, a finals MVP. Oh, they got Giannis on my Bulls. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. He's a nice blue monster. Kyle Lowry's there as well. Kind of strange for that one, but they got Mo Bamba. And Covington, Kelly Oubre Jr., Kobe White still probably improving 85 overall. He kind of sucked in that in 30 minutes, but he... yeah, their team's their team's nice. I don't know. I don't know why we. I mean, I understand why we lost. Anthony Edwards is stupid. The bench sucks a little. Oh, we got a new coach, Brad Stevens. Oh, when did that happen? Was that last season? Is that why we kind of sucked a little bit more? We're running a 10 man rotation. Uh, KD, 95 overall. Last season of his rookie scale, he's got 26 total badges. Catch and shoot corner specialist on Hall of Fame. Um, I don't, 
it's going to be hard for him to average 30 points. Colin Sexton puts up 24 a game. He's a monster. Darius Garland can put up 20 a game as well. K-Love puts up 15. Drummond puts up 12. Uh, Porter Jr. comes in and puts up 13. Like, there's only one basketball. There's so many shots in the game. And uh, I don't know. I don't know if he's going to average ridiculous scoring numbers. I'm really hoping he does. We'll see if they end up keeping him. I mean, they should end up keeping him. They got his uh, bird rights and all that. So if they don't, I mean, a lot of players are on contract. I don't know if they would hit a hard cap, but they should still be able to sign him back, hopefully. Luka continues to win MVP. Ah, okay, 60 wins this time, though. Uh, Bolden, Rookie of the Year. Colt Anthony, still sixth man for them. Uh, Anthony Davis, Defensive Player, Most Improved Player, Evan Mobley. Um, Coach of the Year, Brad Stevens. Is this his first season? I don't know if it's his first season with us. I probably should have checked, but it is what it is kd continues to make an all nba second team let's go look at his numbers does he make an all defensive team i don't think he will quite yet maybe on and is later in his career but we are the number one seed season stats 30 points 24 dude <laughs> oh come on because look at the squad he's got help Colin sexton with 23 darius garland with 21 porter jr off the Bench with 14, Drummond scoring 13. They traded for Blake. Why? Why? Keep K Love. I don't know. Is it a cheaper contract? Is it because it's a shorter contract? Maybe. I don't. But we'll see how far we get into the playoffs. It w KD. KD. KD, what are you doing? The blame's on KD. I don't care if anybody else let him down. I don't care. KD 20, we need 40. Game one, where are you at, KD? Why are you only scoring 16? Game two, where are you at, KD? Why are you only scoring 29? Okay, game two, he played fine. He played fine game. Okay, game three, where are we at? Where are we at? Where are you at, KD? 11 points. I told you it's on KD. Game four, he, he comes back, but, but come on. You truly showed up for two games. Two games. Raptors win it with Emoni Bates. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. He's a monster. He's co he's a complete monster. KD though, where were you at, bro? He does resign. Um, I mean, I didn't expect anything less. He's at least here for another four seasons. Kyle Sexton here for three, and then Gar Darius Garland, same thing. Blake Griffin last season here, last season for Drummond. So we'll see. I'm guessing they're gonna give one of them a big contract. Drummond for sure. Tristan Thompson still here on a sizable contract. Same thing with Seti Osman, where they really got rid of uh Porter. But all right, he's here. We'll see. He's already a 97 overall at the age of 23 years old. I may I I want him to score more, man. I want him to score more, but we have scores, legitimate scores on this team. And I hate it because it's it's hurting him. It's hurting him from becoming that absolutely destructive, absolutely legendary, the best of the best ever. But I guess we'll see if one of these players gets traded away or KD eventually leaves. He'll still have a few seasons to score quite a bit, but not to simulate. Um, and see um, if he can get an MVP, even though he's not going to be able to be scoring a, a ridiculous amount. Damn, Giannis really be out here switching teams. We're only 45 and 37. That's that's not a good sign. That is not a good sign at all. But he's been on Milwaukee. He's been on Chicago. He goes to Sacramento now. KD finally makes an All-NBA first team. Is he scoring a lot more? Um, What, what was it going to look at? Yeah, Detroit. Detroit, the team. No, that's not the team that beat us last season. Miami be beat us last season, right? It was Miami, but anyways, Detroit, absolutely ridiculous. RJ Bear, Anthony Edwards, Bobby Porters, they did beat us one. They got Nikola Jokic, bro. Wow. Okay, now our team kind of just looks mediocre besides Kevin Durant. He scores 27, Sexton scores less, Garland scores way less. Uh, Drummond 13, they got Nico off of one season. Uh, Blake Griffin, Jordan Clarkson for 12 million. Did they trade somebody away? I don't know. I have no idea what the team's up to, but he scores 27. I still want a ridiculous like 35 point season. Maybe it'll happen. Maybe it won't. He's going to play like 42 minutes a game here. Get to. Yes. Okay. There we go. Let's upset some teams now. Let's upset some teams now like they've been upsetting us. No. Okay. Never mind. Uh, I was just kidding. I was just kidding, dude. Sacramento. Who, what does their full squad look like? Giannis gets a championship. Miles Turner. Wait, that team is straight stacked. What the heck, man? what how how do these teams build such like great teams man and we're just stuck here even though we have a great i just think there's some different pieces you need to move around i feel like we need a better a better big combination 
not Blake Griffin and Andre Drummond, to be honest. Things aren't looking too well. Things are not looking too well. Um, they gave a gigantic contract to Drummond, and guess what? He declined. He declined this offseason. They gave him this huge contract up until he's 35 years old. They have Markeith Morris, a 36-year-old power forward. KD a 98 overall now. We got a nice little big three here, but Garland, I don't think he's going to improve too much more. It's the same thing with Kyle Sexton, if I'm being honest. And um, yeah, I could see him leaving Cleveland after his contract is up. The time has come where KD needs to sign with another team. I've said, oh wait, he already signed in the se during the season. Oh no, he signed halfway through the, oh. We are stuck here. We are stuck here. This team's not good for you, KD. One season, they signed two small forwards. No, they had two small forwards coming off my bench, um, off the bench. And, um, well, that's when he averaged 23 points. 23? I don't need that. I don't need that. He scored 27 back to back, and then he scored 23. And now 25 because he wasn't, uh, you know, a million small forwards. But he still only got 32.9 minutes. He got 31 there. 36, 37. I need that. I need that for KD to be the top scorer, the best scorer ever. But he's got to put up ridiculous numbers, not 25 points. Only 26, so by the time this contract's up, he'll be 30 years old. He might decide to go somewhere else there, but the team's not good, man. They have McCourt Maker, but, but you know, he was signed from free agency during the season for like a million dollars, so he's not staying. Drummond's still here for another season. Please don't re-sign him. We need better players. Why did you even resign this guy? He's okay, but this team's just not going to do it for me. It's not going to be enough. I don't think KD can... I don't think so. Well, we made the playoffs every season, but we got knocked out in the first round. I've been simulating a few seasons here and, uh, here and there, and uh, first season that we actually missed the playoffs. Bronny out here winning. It's a second MVP, I'm pretty sure. Rookie of the Year, Shannon Castro, Isaac, Dylan Mason, Judd, Rose, Lloyd Pierce, 59 wins, but we miss out on the playoffs there's no way a 34 win team makes the playoffs but KD still making all nba teams getting all-star appearances stuff like that he finally averaged 30 points last season i'm pretty sure uh this season 27 but last season 30.7 and well he's he's doing what he can 50 40 90 seasons a year after after oh my gosh okay that's one two three four five six Six 50, 40, 90 seasons. It's, it all comes to depth. Everybody else has like a super team. And KD stuck out here on an island with uh, this season, next season. Hopefully he goes somewhere else. Um, like I've been saying, because yikes. Missing out on the playoffs when you have 390 overalls. So they go 33 and 49, but the man resigned last season before. Oh my gosh. He got a contract extension. He got a contract extension. He's here till he's 32 years old. I hate it. I don't like it. He's only going to get one championship, 27 points a game again, eight rebounds. So his rebounds are going a little bit up. Um, why? Why stay? KD finally moves on, but I feel it's a little bit too late. But you never know. He's still only 34 years old. He gave everything to Cleveland. Everything to Cleveland. 15 years in Cleveland. All NBA teams, he gave one championship to them um, in his second season as a 20-year-old. It's it's 14 years later. Will he be able? Will he be able to get another championship? He's got a 93 overall Greg Brown here. He's got Scottie Pippen Jr., but at the same time, they're not good. They're not good. They're not really that good. I, I don't see it being better, but you never know. New team, three seasons, three-year contract. He should start declining sometime soon. Of course, he's a 99 overall, so he'll stay as a 90 for a few more seasons. But yikes. But yikes. After it all went downhill after the championship. No freaking way. His first season with the Blazers. It's 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 insane. The team that the, the real life KD that got passed up on for Greg Oden. Greg Oden going to the Blazers, but now video game resimulation KD goes to Portland. What what storyline is this? Kevin Durant wins MVP with them in his first season with them as a 34-year-old. Wow, Derek Bellamy, coach of I mean coach, rookie of the year, Jeffrey Bird, six man defensive player, Dylan Mason, Tyler Wesley. They're 57 and 25. Quinn Snyder finishes better than them. Of course, he may wow, I was expecting zero MVP awards. They're second. Oh, <laughs> I don't know. 
I don't know about the team, to be honest. He scores 29.9. Greg Brown's still a beast uh, at 33 years old. Uh, Mik Mikhail? Michael? I don't know. I don't know how you would say that. He's from, from Sweden, I guess. Uh, 17 a game. Uh, Felix Ramirez, 14 a game. Isaiah Stewart, 14 a game. I don't know if this team's good enough. They got uh, Scotty Pippen Jr., who we had since the beginning of the season. We'll see. Championship number two. First season with a new team. He wins the MVP award up against Phoenix. What? How do we match up against other teams now? Since it's been a minute. So there's like three 90s right there. A low 80 and then a 90. And almost, almost two 90s off the bench, bruh. Bruh. Are you kidding? I just want to see how we would match up like this. So not too far off from their point guard. Better shooting guard on our spot. Obviously a better small forward with KED. A better power forward. Okay, so... And then 10 overall better in their center. But does Vernon Carey score a lot? Oh, did I just simulate one game? I just simulated one game. I wanted to simulate the entire round. And we are out of there. Phoenix. Ha! <sighs> that sucks. That sucks. But what is great is that he gets an MVP award. He gets at least one MVP award. That helps a lot in his... Uh, in, for his case of, like, greatest of all time or something. I just want to make sure he doesn't just randomly retire out of nowhere. Because that would suck. There's Ivica. He retires. He was on the Trailblazers. Just make sure I don't see a Trailblazer, you know, logo out there. And for some reason, I skip it. And he's gone. I will be honest with you guys. I did not expect KD to retire this early. I'm going to see first how many points he has. If he's close to, um, you know, the leading score in Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Where is he at? He's 40. Oh. Oh, well, goddamn. <laughs> Oh, well, is he number one, though? Because there's some ridiculous people. I'm going to go look at the numbers right now, and I'm going to simulate one more season. I'm going to make him stay in the league. Wait, where can I Can I not see it? Where NBA records. KD's number one. He can retire in peace. Maybe that's why he played one more season there. I don't know. I don't know. But KD, the real KD is number four. Resim KD is number one, 43,000 points. We'll go look at his other. We'll let him retire in peace. We'll let him retire in peace. One MVP, one championship. Hall of Fame inductee right there. Average 26 a game, seven rebounds, 5.4 assists, 1.6 steals, 1.5 blocks. Now, we, of course, jersey retirement for him. Where's he at? Where is he at? Right there. Number 35, Cleveland Cavaliers, 15 seasons and retired with Portland. MVP award for him in Portland, of course. So that was a pretty big deal and how many i gotta see all his all his accolades ties kareem abdul jabbar for number one all time uh all-star appearances which is 19 um mvp award in 2036 nba championship just won unfortunately um i guess maybe it's because he didn't want to leave he didn't want to leave cleveland for some reason he wasn't a snake in this in this resim eight First team all nbas nine second team all nbas one time third team all nba so he was cons consistently either first team or second team rookie of the year first team all rookie now we go look at his other numbers which are going to be absolutely ridiculous and number one in total points we saw that he's not even number one in field goals made he's number four kd number five in all-time three-pointers made lebron james jr that's all he does that's all he shoots his threes he's got seven that's kind of insane uh but kd Fifth on the all-time list for that. And then third all-time free throws made. He also did finish 34th in assists, which is pretty ridiculous. Um, And then blocks. He should be up here somewhere. He was pretty consistent with his blocks. Um, Over one a game. There he is, 15th. 15th all-time in blocks. Third all-time in steals. John Stockton's a monster. But anyways, third all-time in steals. 15th in blocks. Number one in scoring. Like, And he didn't even get the most minutes. He could have still continued to play. He retires at the age of 38. Not even 20 seasons played. He probably could have made an all the all-star appearance and beat Kareem's all-time uh, uh, 19 all-star appearances. Insane. Insane. LeBron gets more minutes. KD right there, 56,000. I also did expect him to get maybe more MVP awards, but since he did have a lot of scoring on his Cleveland Cavalier team, it was kind of tough. And then eventually when he finally left in his first season away from Cleveland, he wins an MVP award, gets only one championship. I also expected more there, but like I said, drop a like, drop a comment, subscribe if you are new. But as always, guys, thanks for watching.